I'm concerned you did right by me. Thanks, Kenny. Still, I guess some people aren't going to be happy with your choices. What is wrong Kenny, with Kenny? Please. Come here, please. He didn't make it, did he? He lost too much blood. God damn it. I'm getting sick of this shit. Ken, come back. There's nothing... Let him go, Captain. What? He just needs time. It's been a rough morning. Yeah. That man you brought, I tried, but he was never going to survive. At least he's not our problem. What about the other kid? That's a good question. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh god.
So, this dairy, you guys really have food? Sure do. We lost most of the cattle, but we still have lots of milk, butter, and cheese stocked up. And with the vegetables we grow, we got plenty of food. It's nice to get away from that motel for a while. This Lily Kenny thing is starting to get ridiculous. Personally, I'd be happier if you started to take charge more. Uh, Kenny uh, keeps up motivated. Kenny keeps us motivated. He believes in hope and knows how important it is for us not to give that up. I can't fault him for that. Or maybe you just don't want to be in charge. Well, not everyone thinks I'm so trustworthy. Because of your past. Does anyone else know? Uh, just you. Just you? Well, I haven't told anyone. Clementine might know. She was there when we were talking in the drugstore. Ask me about it. I lied to her. What exactly did happen with the senator? Um. Uh, you know what happened. You know what happened. I only know what the press was told. I don't know your story. Sometimes I wonder if I should talk to the group about it. You don't have to. Whatever happened before things went to hell doesn't matter anymore. Yeah. I'm sure everyone would see it that way. Maybe you're right. Listen, over the years I've reported on some pretty messed up shit. I've seen situations like yours a hundred times. It doesn't have to make you a bad man. I uh, really appreciate that. I mean, thank God Lee showed up when he did. Right, Lee? Yeah, why don't you tell us a little more about yourself, Lee? Where are you from? Uh, I grew up in Macon. I grew up in Macon. Right here in the heart of Jaw. That's what I like to hear. Y'all seem pretty settled in at that motor in. Uh, who's running things over there? Uh, Lily, Kenny, I am. It's democracy. We work as a group. All of us looking out for each other. I hear that. There's so many dumbasses out there fighting each other these days. It's just stupid. How many people you got over there, anyway? Uh, nine, including the kids. Not enough to defend yourselves. Nine, including the kids. You forgot Ben. Me? That makes it ten. Well, we'd love to get you all out to the dairy. Like I said, we got plenty of food, and quite frankly, we could always use an extra helping hand. In the summers, I used to help out on a goat farm. Yeah, that's great. Everything helps. Mama's been running the dairy for as long as I can remember. Now it's... You think you're going to cut me out of this? Shoot me down. No one's trying to cut you out of anything. You and Gary are always pulling the bandits. Who? Oh, never know. Those look like the people who oh, raided my camp. Are they? Fuck you. You knew we were hungry. And you guys were keeping it up for yourself. Oh, no. Yeah, and you know what? He ate it all. What are you going to fucking do about it? Don't worry. Annie and I got you covered with something bad. Let's just wait this out. Oh god. For bandits. Now they're on the farm. Or it seems like that. Oh yeah. Here it is. St. John's family deck. Looks nice. Y'all can see how we kept this place so safe. The fence keeps them out. You betcha, they fry like bugs in a zapper. We're pushing 4,000 volts through that thing, with generators and amps. I'm going to assume that's a lot. Uh, ever have any accidents? Ever have any accidents? Nah, it's safer here than out there. This place looks untouched. You'd never know the rest of the world is in ruins. It's worth protecting. Hence all the juice. 